Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Milburn is brought to you by Cooperman Barnabas Medical Center in Livingston. Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Seton Hall Prep is being brought to you by One on One with Steve Adubato. The Greater Newark Tournament is celebrating its 90th year in 2023, and we've got a good one in this year's final. Steven Echevarria is having a stellar senior season with top seeded Milburn. The right-handed Florida commit draws the start in one of the biggest games of the year for the Millers. They meet with Seton Hall Prep for the third time. It's the rubber match. This is one of North Jersey's best public-private rivalries. Echevarria came into this game with 65 Ks over six starts. His first comes in the opening inning of this game. Later in the first, a man on second for James Grisetti. The single drops, but Jack Meyerowitz fires a seed to home. There's a play at the plate. He's out. Shy Abbott absorbs contact and hangs on. Abbott shakes it off. He's fine. But this throw from Meyerowitz to end the inning was A+. It was the start of a big day for Milburn's defense. Elijah Foster got the start for the Pirates. He cruises through the bottom half of the inning, recording three strikeouts. We're scoreless through one. Both pitchers were grooving in this game. Foster gives Milburn fits and collects his fifth punch out here, while Echevarria on the other end works his third strikeout. We're still not at 0-0 going to the bottom of the fourth. And that is where the Millers offense kicks into gear. They will load the bases for Ethan Axelrod. He turns on one. Axelrod sends a line drive off the wall. Two runners come in to score. Axelrod's loud single puts Milburn in front 2-0 through four full innings. Bottom five now after a leadoff knock. Robert Schneider works his way to third after two wild pitches. Kaigo Fujita does a great job fighting off a two-strike pitch and skying this one to right field. Schneider will tag up and score. Milburn extends their lead to 3-0 at the end of five. Now we go to the top of the seventh. Echevarria is still out there dealing. Strikeout number five is the first out of the inning. And then it's Echevarria who ends the game with strike three. Milburn shuts out Seton Hall Prep to capture the 2023 GNT title. 3-0 is the final. Echevarria allowed only three hits over seven shutout innings and did so on only 89 pitches. Milburn wins their second GNT title in the last three years. That second time through the order, I owe it all to my teammates, you know. Me, Alex Wilson, Matt Wiener, we've all been working hard at lunch. And to see Wilson get up there, hit a rip to right center, have Wiener get on, you know, it made my job easy. And at the end of the day, Steven threw strikes, we made plays, and that's why we came out on top. I mean, I wouldn't be able to do it without my defense. I mean, today, no, I mean, strikeouts were lower. This is my third time facing them. I knew coming in they were going to, you know, bang some balls around. And they started piecing them a little bit. I mean, my... Henry Jacobs in center field makes some crazy plays. Second baseman, shortstop. I mean, everyone made plays, and it was really helpful. And I could not give enough credit to Shy uh, Abbott behind the play. He's fantastic all year. I mean, I couldn't do it without him either. Reporting from Verona, I'm Jay Cook, JerseySportsZone.com.